Hey there, and welcome to Capacity Middle East Extra, powered by JSA. That's us, JSA. I am Dean Perrine, and we are live on location at the Extravagant. This is a very, very nice hotel, isn't it? Yes. At the Extravagant um, Dubai, Hyatt Dubai Hotel. And I am here with Mr. Vivek Manglick. Vivek is the Senior Vice President and Business Head at Airtel business. Is that yes. correct? I yes. Got it? Yes, Dean. Excellent. Yeah. Vivek, thank you very much for being here with us. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, Dean, for inviting me. It's an opportunity and an honor to be part of this interview session or Excellent. discussion. Well, very good. So why don't we start by, well, why don't you start actually by telling our viewers what makes Airtel unique? Yeah, okay. Uh, first and foremost thing which comes to my mind is the confidence of our partners that okay. what we are doing in the market to actually drive the transformation, that's that comes as a first point to me. Mm -hmm. The second is we are a one stage technology partner serving solutions across connectivity, mobile, mobility, mm -hmm. IoT, mm -hmm. infrastructure, CPaaS, ad tech, and you name it all. So the ecosystem is being served and they believe, our customers do believe about how Airtel is going into this technology transformation, right? And the third thing is basically what we're trying to drive is through our four pillars is that what we have is the capacities across terrestrial cable systems. Mm -hmm. B is we have a lot of insights on 480 million subscribers across 16 countries. How can we actually drive that? Third is the uh, how we are making the systems seamless, simple, easy to actually in a journey of integration and digital transformation for the organization. Excellent. So you mentioned CPaaS. Yes. So we can't we can't uh, can't let this interview go any further without oh. discussing CPaaS, the the technology of the future. Why don't you tell us a little bit about uh, your your uh, CPaaS solution? Oh, okay. CPaaS is a buzzword today in the industry, it really and, every, is. and everybody is talking <laughs> about CPaaS, right? But you see, and me and you are seeing that there's been drastic change the way we want to communicate with our customers mm -hmm. and over the last decade the change has been too much uh, and there's a radical shift in the communication technologies mm -hmm. we are living in an experience economy right yeah. today we want to have the our brands or our association communicate with us the way we want to experience in our private lives so and so does the business yeah. and brands yeah, are yeah. also moving into that direction yeah and that's why CPAS becomes very important because maybe I'm today on a WhatsApp channel or you are on a, a let's say, Telegram channel. These are complex technologies. Can we create one interface which gives more affordable, secure solution and cost effective? So that's where we feel that CPAS is becoming more and more important, coupled with the experience economy which we are trying to drive, right? So the brands would like to use various channels to see right ROIs into yeah. uh, coming up there because they're spending money on it. And CPAS becomes as, I believe, as a solution going forward to actually help in those initiatives. Yeah, the, to hear you describe it, it, there's a reason it's a very buzzy term. Yes. Uh, because it is a very important, kind of important way forward, an important, important way yes. into the future. Yes. But so speaking of, you know, important things, um, tell me about Airtel IQ. Yeah, thank you for asking that question. And uh, I would love to share some of my views on it. Airtel IQ is the journey towards when we re realize that CPAS is the future technology and all that. So we are trying to do a very integrated first telco grade solution where we actually leverage our network capabilities and give a, a seamless journey for uh, for our customers, whether there could be enterprise, global carriers, MNOs and all that. And what we are doing is we have a communication suite on Airtel IQ, which is we sell it as intelligent communications. B is hosted contact centers, uh, multi-office telephony, right, mm -hmm. and um, and 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 a couple of other things which are under in the development stage. So that's that's what we are trying to drive on the Atel IQ, and we are getting good engagement. And when I started with, uh, our discussion, is that the customers are also giving us a thumbs up the, on the initiative. That's and this, yes, yes, <laughs> and and that's what the trust which we are building as Atel yeah. in the global community as to how 
we are going into the digital transformation journey. Vivek, a lot going on over there at Airtel. We appreciate your time today. Thank you so much. You it bet. was indeed a pleasure. You bet. And thank, thank you, you viewers for watching uh, the program. And uh, we will uh, we'll see you very soon. Thank you. You bet.